now we are having our conversation here. I want that dream to come to pass. So in some years time, I'll come and ask of you here and then they will show me where you are and then we'll get to meet you in your green and white. Okay, for sure. But no, I don't want to work in, in Ghana. You want to be out of the country? Yes, because you see Ghana, they don't have the facilities to help you. No, like, you see, when I go to abroad, they teach me what's more of their things. But Ghana, they just, they're just like everything is based on money. So, like, even if I work here and stuff, like when I go to abroad, to I can like they can teach me more stuff so that I can come and help Ghana. Which of the countries abroad do you want to go to? Mm -hmm. Right, you're still watching 24 Hours TV today. I've met one of La, La's beautiful empress that has a very great vision for the community and. The entire country yes she's going to talk with me on 24 hours tv so stick and stay i'm going for a quick break when i return we get into the conversation right it's another beautiful day and we are still at the la community talking to amazing people it's gonna be exciting uh bringing you updates that you need to get now i was searching all around la I've spoken to the kings, the queens, the priests, and then now I've finally gotten a daughter of the land. I'm going to ask her what she thinks about the La Homoa Festival, what's her passion, and a lot of uh, questions right here on 24 Hours TV. Let me greet her with the ball rolling. What's your name? My name is Mary Jade. Mary Jade. Mary Jade, that's powerful. Wow. We are celebrating the La Homoa Festival. What do you have to say about this very festival? It's a festival that we've been celebrating. We've been celebrating it over the years. We, not now, but over the years before I could go, I could see that the, this kind of festival was already something that we already. So, like we also joined, and then we. That's what I know, for now. So each year that the festival is coming on, what do you think? Do you get happy that you're going to see your friends? Yeah, like people from far, far camp, like people that, you see, in La, our lands are not just, so some people travel out, they come back to celebrate, so we are very excited to get, to see them, get in touch with them, yes. What do you want to do when you grow up? I want to be a nurse. Oh, you want to be a nurse? Yes. Oh, I was just told that the la, people growing up have passion to become nurses and other stuff. So, okay, why do you want to become a nurse? Um, I want to become a nurse because I could see that a lot in our society, a lot of people are afraid to get involved in those stuffs. So our health problems is very low and like, and I really, really want to help the community. I want to be someone important in the community. That's why I want to be a nurse. That's powerful. Okay. What do you have to tell young ladies in the community? What advice would you like to give them? Seeing what is going on in the community, what advice will you give your colleagues, people your age? All I'll say is they should relax. That's all. Relax. And everything. Why do you say they should relax? Mm, because. You think they are rushing or something? Yes. Because they want to do what elders, elders do and stuff. Like, okay. I just want to tell them they should just relax because my dad always says, when you start early, you will finish early. Okay. So I'm just telling you to just relax. Yes. It will get to their thing, that's all. That's powerful. We're still live on 24 Hours TV. Um, so what are, you, what are you currently studying? I'm studying home accounts, food and nutrition. That can help me go to um, nursing easily. Uh, I saw your mom selling there. No, she's my grandma. Oh, she's your grandma. Okay, that's powerful. So you're helping her sometimes? Yes, please. Oh, okay. You don't feel like going to party and all that? Nah. It's once in a while that I, c I come to her. Oh, okay. I don't live around here. Oh, okay. So, yeah. That's powerful. Okay. So what advice would you also give to the people of La um regards to the election coming up? Are you going to vote? Are you of age? Oh no, no, I'm just sixteen years. Sixteen years. Ooh. So I can't vote. Wow. Yes, but you see, I want to tell the youth to, to calm down. They shouldn't fight over some one C D and two C D money. They shouldn't fight. They should just vote peacefully and pick the right person and 
I would say they should stop insulting the um, president and staff. Yes, because when we say the government, we are also the government. So they should just stop insulting the president and staff. Like, it's not helping them at all. And I'm, st I'm telling the president to help the youth as well to get jobs and stuff. So that In the local community? Yes. What are some of the jobs you think we don't have here that if we should get, it will help the community? Oh, I have nothing in mind. But all I can say is they can create jobs, new jobs for them because now the youth really needs money and any job that comes, they'll just get involved. So if it's a good job, they should just bring it out so that they can work with it. That's all. 16 years in, in school, are you getting pressure on boyfriend influence? Oh, nah. Have anybody tried coming to talk to you? Oh, a lot, but... So what, what do you tell them? Mm, I just tell them my age. And still they insist. Okay, so where do you put them? So I tell my mom. Okay. And then my mom will just say something to them and then they just won't talk to me again. Okay. That's, That's powerful. Okay. Because you have a target and you know that that target you should fulfill it. One of the homo was I would want to come with my cameras, come and ask around this area. They will make me search for you. I want to see that dream of you being the next come true so we can talk again. I hope you get me. Yeah, not really. Okay. Now we are having our conversation here. I want that dream to come to pass. So in some years time, I'll come and ask of you here. And then they will show me where you are. And then we'll get to meet you in your green and white. Okay, for sure. But I don't, I don't want to work in <laughs> Ghana. You want to be out of the country? Yes, because you see, Ghana, they don't have the facilities to help you. No, like, you see... When I go to abroad, they teach me what's more of their things. But Ghana, they just, they're just like everything is based on money. So, like, even if I work here and stuff, like when I go to abroad, too, I can, like, they can teach me more stuff so that I can come and help Ghana. Which of the countries abroad do you want to go to? Mm, US. You want to go to US? Yes. I see. I see. That's powerful. Okay, so if you make it big time in the US, what would you like to? What would be the first thing you would like to do for Ghana or your community, Laba? Mm -hmm. Ola. I would like to build a hospital and employ people because there are good people in the nursing industry, but just because of money, they can't fulfill their wishes and stuff. But I pray that my God will help my mom and my dad to just get me what I want and everything I want so that I can just fulfill my dreams. Yes. So, if I build the hospital, I'll just pull people that are in the nursing training college that they have to work and stuff and then put them inside. What name would you possibly give the hospital? Are you going to put your name on it or your dad or your mom's name on it? Mm, I have, it's not in mind now. So, I, I wouldn't say that. But that's your target, right? Yes. That's what you want to do. Yeah. You have sisters? No. You have brothers? It's only me. I have brothers, but they're just like, yeah, my sister have brothers and stuff. Oh, okay. It's only you. Yes. That's why you need to protect yourself. Yes. And you try. Mm, I, since I have step brothers and I, they love me as I love them, so I have no problem with that one. Yes. Good, good, good. Musically, um, in the music industry, who is your favorite artist? Mm, in Ghana. In Ghana, I would say I would choose Black Sharif. Oh, you're feeling Black Sharif. What's your favorite song on Black Sharif's playlist? Um, let's see. Um, um, um was First Sermon and stuff. First Sermon, can you give a line on First Sermon? No, 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 no. Okay, so <laughs> which other country do you, do you have a favorite song coming from? Okay, Nikki. Nicki Minaj. Okay. Yes. And then Cardi B. You have any of their songs you can sing? Mm, yes. Give a freestyle. Okay. I don't let this hoes bother me. Don't let this hoes bother me. <laughs> no, let's go. Let's go. I want to hear you on 24 hours. Let's no. That's what I can say. That's what I can sing. Yeah. Okay. So let's come back to first time on Black Sherry. Okay. I can't sing actually oh, because okay. it's kind of difficult. Okay. Yeah. So I can't sing. Yes. It's, it's, it's been nice talking to you on 24 Hours TV. 
it's a great conversation what's the name again mary jade mary jade oh that's a beautiful name that's a beautiful name mm, no like my friends nah like i've not received any bad advice from anyone so, so far which good advice has your friends given you no my friends they always encourage me not to give up most things uh, were you trying to give up at a time or something like when our bc results came in like i was expecting a thing but i got another number and then i was like i felt awful because i knew what i can do and i didn't do it so it's like you see when you don't learn or when you learn people won't know when you feel that you learned so like i felt so bad and my dad was like i say i learned but we couldn't see it in your paper and a whole lot of talk so like i felt bad and were like i should just i should just forget all those things and go to shs and prove to them and then, then so okay so that's a good advice i can say my friends have given me yes. that's powerful what story did you hear in the community when you were growing up what has your dad been telling you about that mm. So far, my daddy wouldn't say anything about la, but he would always say I should be careful. I should be careful because in this community, it seems like we are not safe. Mm -hmm. So, like, they just fight anyhow. Among themselves? Mm. Is it because of land or what? No, not really. Like, maybe, as I was talking, as the jobs and stuff, so maybe someone just bought a television or something and then the person in the person's room and then someone will try to open the door and take it out and then they'll fight and when they fight another people will get involved and blah 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 and sell it to the muslims is it because they they contributed to buy the television no not really the person that stole it actually will sell it to the um, muslims and the muslims will also when they like maybe they've caught the person and then they take the person to the place and the muslims they have to bring it back they won't agree because we all know muslims they don't agree to stuff and then they'll just be like um we won't bring it we are going to this place we are going to this place and then some people won't understand and then all sorts of fights result into fight it wouldn't be a simple fight too mm, there will be a fight where knife and stuff just okay that is what makes it unsafe to be here yes okay apart from that what makes a lot beautiful to you mm, our culture our language our food um our music what is the common food you can get in the la community kinky mm, you can get kinky easily and food because that's our our food and prepare it very well yes so you can say the best kinky comes from la yes and then our music, as I've said already, our music, our language. Which of the music coming from the La land that you can sing? Mm, I can't sing any because, you see, I don't really focus on the, on that aspect. Okay. Yes. Following Nicki Minaj people. <laughs> so I don't really follow that aspect. Are you a Christian? Yeah, I'm a Christian. Very strong one. Yeah. I see. Well, okay. So apart from those... Uh, TV issues. Every other thing is beautiful at La. Yes. Apart from all this fight and everything. If they should take that thing out, La is a very beautiful place to be in. And a very entertaining place to be in. What are some of the entertainments? Mm, the music, the dance, when people come around. Like, as we are celebrating our festivals, people come around. Like, the houses, you see people shouting, laughing like giving hypes to other people coming we've missed you those stuff makes it's cool during this uh homo festival have you met any new friend um yeah a lot you met a lot of people they, they came to you how did they connect with you oh just maybe someone will be like hi be like hello oh i'm i'm from ashanti and i want to experience this so then then they will like be like oh okay it's just this is what we are doing, so you can just involve yourself. Yes, that's all. That's powerful. You're still watching 24 Hours TV. This is where we draw curtains on our conversation with this last beautiful empress that wants to become a nurse, uh, but she won't stay in Ghana.
she will go to Nicki Minaj's place <laughs> in the U.S. and then come back and build a hospital. Thank you very much for making time for us to talk. Thank you. Like you're welcome as well. Right. So till we meet again, same time, another time on Twenty Four Hours TV. Bye bye.